What is going on, buddy? Dan on Filter Trader in flames, delight and angers. It's a weird song title. You'd think it would be delight and anger, or delights and angers. Whatever. Let's let. Who knows? Who knows? <laughs> this going from Charles. If you guys have any quests, just hit me up. Shout out to the fans in the front row who were all into it, singing it with their fucking heart. Always like that. Transition. That's nice. Surprisingly emotional song. Yeah. good see that's a prime example that you can be a heavy song like I wasn't extremely heavy obviously but it was a it was a heavy song and still be very emotional like that that's a lyrically extremely emotional even tonally like any transition they had into the choruses the pre-chorus was just a which that's a kind of a rare thing normally pre-choruses when you have them you know there's, there's like a, vocals None. Their pre-chorus was just a guitar riff and the tone shift of everything got kind of kind of soft for a couple bars before the actual chorus dropped. Same with the bridge. The bridge, there was no vocal. It was just, what do you mean, like, or a breakdown, really. Unless you consider that a breakdown, like a super soft one. But it was just, it got emotional for a minute. 
Good stuff. I Again, they probably don't. Bands usually don't. It would be awesome if there were some uh, cover of this, some reimagined, you know what I mean, some uh, remixed where it was all stripped down. A An acoustic version, an acoustic version of this would be awesome. Anders and an acoustic guitar, and if you want, you know, if you want the drummer with the little the little paintbrush looking things, just to just softly play, cool. I think with the because the way that song was kind of put together and the uh, the lyrics of it, you could do that acoustically or piano ballad. I don't know if a- does Anders work with a piano ballad. I guess he could. I guess he could. But an acoustic version of this would absolutely crush. It would be awesome. Let me know what you guys think down below. And I am. I also. I'm. I'm glad that uh, like this is footage, obviously from probably multiple concerts. Maybe the same one. Could be the same one, but usually they use clips from like multiple concerts of the same song. I appreciate that the fans didn't mosh pit. <laughs> Salute, Inflamed fans, whoever, where, wherever this was, if it was in Sweden or wherever they did perform this video. Mad respect, because most of the time, you'll see moshing to songs that don't need moshing. This one, you don't mosh to this. This headbang if you need, Bob, put the put up the horns, do all that. You don't need to be moshing to this. This is an emo- this is an emotional song. Let, let's let's save it for for most of other in flame songs. Not this one. So I, I'm glad. Because again, most of the time they mosh in the videos to everything, no matter what it is. Green Day could pop on, Nickelback, and people be moshing. It's crazy. Weird world we live in. If you are still here, then you are. Hey, everyone. Good stuff, man. Good stuff.